What's cracking, yo? Welcome back to Boo TV. Appreciate you for stopping in. Like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell, stay notified, and let's get into the topic for today. Back with another reaction video back in the world of the Black Mamba, aka Kobe Bryant. You have been warned, this is a long video of Kobe Bryant Ultimate Game Winners and uh, Clutch Shots compilation. Over 40 minutes of clutch shots by Kobe Bryant. Now, if that doesn't tell you that somebody is clutch, now you got over 40 minutes of video footage of this guy hitting daggers and keeping his team alive, then I don't know what else to tell you. And I can guarantee you, after watching this video, I haven't even seen the video yet, but I already know there's going to be a lot of clutch moments that aren't even on here that Kobe Bryant has graced us with. In the uh, in our history of the league, there's I've, I've realized that there's not as much footage from you know his first mm, I don't know seven or eight years back when he had the fro, and then even when he cut the fro off, and he went with the with the fade um, up until Shaq left. There's not as much rare footage of Kobe from back in those days. Not as much as it is the post Shaq era. You know, um, Kobe, in my opinion, is one of the most clutch players of all time. Kobe, in my opinion, is also the greatest difficult shot maker in the history of the league that I have ever seen. The guy had a net for hitting highly improbable shots and if this, uh, Phil Jackson once said, they said, who are you going to take, Kobe or, or MJ for the final shot? And, and and Phil basically said, if it's not verbatim, but Phil said, you know, if it's two seconds or less or three seconds or less, I want Kobe because he hits high, highly difficult shots with more regularity. But if there's time to, you know, get set, run a play or run an isolation play, I'm taking MJ with a little bit more time on the clock because he was better in those situations. You know what I mean? So I think that's a fair way of putting it. Um, Kobe Bryant's... Kobe Bryant would regularly practice. You, you see him hit these crazy shots at crazy angles and all kinds of things. But these are shots that he practiced a lot. There wasn't much in his repertoire that he hadn't practiced, but he also had a net to get impromptu when need be. A lot of late game scenarios that Kobe was in, he practiced on a regular basis. There was rarely times where he was in a position that he was unfamiliar with or uncomfortable with because he always, he's always practiced it. And he trusts his work, he trusts his time, effort, and his craft so that when the time comes to do it on the big stage, he would be able to perform. I think Kobe gets a little bit of a bad rap for being a, they say he takes a lot of bad shots. Yeah, did Kobe take bad shots in his career? Yes. Was it the norm every single game? No, it wasn't. Yeah, there were games where he'd shoot over triple teams, shoot over double teams, wave off the open man, take a more difficult shot. Those, those days did exist. But it was hardly the norm on a game-to-game -game basis. So I think it's a little bit unfair to paint him in that light. It's just that it was magnified because he was an aggressive scorer and an aggressive shot, to, shot taker. But yeah, he, he did. He did. And if people are going to say the, the, the fadeaway, the post fadeaway and the long jumpers bad shots well i disagree that's shots that he practiced with regularity and he would hit with regularity at a 45 to 50 percent clip because he was just that damn elite all right that was his bread and butter but anyway enough of me talking let's get into these uh these clutch highlights of kobe being bryant one of the greatest to ever do it let's check it out the most important thing uh i think for the mask mamba to understand that things these things are possible you know like you don't want to ever limit your imagination or limit what's possible because people may think you're crazy right but if us as athletes don't think that it's possible to do these things how in the world can we inspire people mm. well i could listen to kobe preach all day oh this was in the playoffs kobe got the rebound Two 
Hell of a rebound. Ah, this was the game where they came back from being down by like 30 against the Dallas Mavericks. They were down big. And they stormed back to win the game. This was the one falling down on his butt. Wearing the Kobe twos. I don't know how he played in those shoes, man. I had a pair. Those are not basketball shoes. J. Kidd with the colored hair. This was on Christmas. This is a Christmas Day game. Double team came. He hung in the air. Double clutched it. The ball comes in. Kobe's got it. Above the three-point line. Taking a little bit of time. One dribble pull up. For the win. He's got it. The Lakers win. Kobe. Kareem Rush. Again, it, it never ceases to amaze me, though, why teams won't make other players beat them. I remember this shot. My word. Over Yao Ming. Oh, my goodness. Did he even see the basket? Yao stepped out. Kobe said, you can step out all you want. I'm elevating. I'm going up. And I'm getting a quick one up. <laughs> wow, what a shot by number eight, Kobe Bryant. Yao's there. He started by Harry. Straddling the three-point line on the right wing. Kobe up, a head pick, stutter step, steps back, 19. Oh, he made another one. What a shot. Mm. Kobe pops out. Kobe's going to go. Couple of left-handed dribbles. Has a look at it. That was the first game of the season in 2004. After the uh, sexual assault allegations going on. Those were the uh, Robo Kobe days where he had that sleeve. Dude, I remember that game. My dad fell asleep. I was I started screaming and celebrating. Fortunately, the Lakers would go on to lose the next three games. Right now, there was never a day where Kobe didn't have confidence in his jump shot. You're coming down. I'm going up. And what else is going in? That beautiful jumper. There's only .9 left. Kobe says, fake, up, fall away. Very technically sound. The play of the game, though. He had great fundamentals. Kobe says, with 0.9 to play, looking at the clock, he says, let me see what I want to do. Head fake. Go ahead and take the bait, Bogans. Up, up, and away. Very nice play. Ah. Uh, this, this, this game is just incredible. I actually have a video about this game right here and these two clutch baskets he hit in this game. One to force overtime and one to win the game. This was in the 2003-2004 season. This was, I think, the last game of the season. And with this victory, the Lakers clinch their, clinch their division with the victory and clinch their seeding.
against Ruben Patterson, the Kobe stopper. So dead, so dead. That was amazing defense. Same, this is the same game after he just forced overtime. Same game, double overtime. Crazy. Oh, I remember this damn game. I think that was the first game of the season. 05-06 season. Got him jumping with the hezzy. Dude, look at his form. Beautiful. Beautiful form. That was a crazy ass shot. That's a pull up, baby. Told you the rest is up to the creator. Get the ball to number eight. You never know what's going to happen. Wearing the Iversons. The honeycombs. I mean, he just reared up and buried it long distance. Kobe's got it in that court with three. Kobe with two behind the back into the air. The follow at the buzzer. Back to it. Kobe banks on a three point shot. How many times have you seen it over the years? Kobe Bryant, time running down. Now this this wasn't uh, this wasn't the end of the fourth quarter. Oh, I remember this game. Kobe cooking LeBron James. Three straight possessions. Fadeaway three. I remember watching this game. Ah, this game. I was in college. Dude, I was screaming so loud they thought somebody was dying in the dorm. Time flies, man. It was my freshman year of college. How many times are we going to show this replay now? Move on to the game winner. We know what's coming next. You know what I love? You know what I love about that play right there is even though Kobe hit the big shot and he'll get all the praise for it, you see the praise that he's given Smush Parker right now for the defensive play to even make that happen. Kobe went to him. Went to him to praise him. 
and thank him and tell him that's how you do it boy that's how you do it that's what we need all that type of shit in his ear he went to smush because smush made it possible i love that moment that smush smush never got credit for it the media won't talk about it but kobe knew smush made that happen no timeouts here now i like that One point game Walton can tip it. Bryant with the save. Now you're going to get a shot here. Final seconds. Bryant for the win. Bang! Ah. Uh. Kobe was killing people that season, man. Dude was on a mission. Man, we should have won that series against freaking Phoenix, man. That game six. Still can't believe we lost game six. Couldn't get a goddamn rebound. Couldn't get a... Come on with the replays. He's a light port one up. Finding Kobe beyond the arc again. And again, comes through in the clutch. One point game, 96-95. Wow. Incredible. He's got 53. That's amazing. Now, can they get the takeaway? Zach Randolph. Bonnie going for the steal. Look out. Zach Randolph stripped from behind and out of bounds. It'll belong to the Blazers. Now, Kobe for the tie. Got it. Dude, bucket after bucket after bucket. And with that guy, it's not a desperation three, I guess. Dude, look what he did there. His ability to tightrope that the the out of bounds line. Watch this. He saw. Don't forget this group just gave up an uncontested layup. He made sure that he wasn't touching the basketball. Flung it in front of him. Super smart. Three second differential though between the game clock and shot clock. Bryant got the step. And Greg Popovich. They're going to trap this pick and roll here tomorrow and try to make him give the ball up. That, dude, that is strength. That is strength right there. He out the double team and then took the ball right where he wanted. That's just a brilliant play. Double double. Kobe. Hard to believe. Are you kidding me? Unreal. Are you? You saw how he handled that trap in the corner. You have got to be joking. Somebody On Brandon Roy. Unreal. Yeah, we are. We're definitely spoiled. Oh my goodness. Watching one of the very best to ever play the game. Now. Brandon Roy was a bad boy. I'm about to do a Brandon Roy video. I'm going to do a Brandon Roy video. Because some people would argue that Brandon Roy was the second or third best shooting guard at the time. Oh, I remember this game. I was in Orlando at my friend's house. Everybody was asleep. This is where he did the big balls. Seems like 
despite what kind of a shooting night he's having. He it's funny how much things have changed. Back then, not a word was said about the big nuts. And then LeBron did it, like, what, last year or this season or last season? And he got in trouble for it. Times have changed. So that somebody else beats him. Well, he's got the ball. He's got it. The Lakers should just open the court up. He should wait until about five seconds before he takes his move. It's down to seven. Starting to make his move for the win. He got the lead for him. 123-121. 4.3 to play. Going to his left. Pull up. Splash. And the crowd says, we knew that was going to happen, didn't they? He's had to take a lot of shots, but they've needed it, I guess. Oh, yeah. This last one. The defender. This was when Kevin Durant was a rookie. And the picture says, yeah, Kobe, this is a game he shot too much. This was a game where I was like, dude, you're shooting too much. Disaster when you give him an opportunity. There's Kobe. He'll slam it. 86-84. Jack out of control. And Kobe will take it away. The three. Yes! With seven tenths of a second to play. Kobe he is going to be guarded by Rudy Gay now. Not O.J. Mayo. He's got the pick. He's got the pop. The three. Yes! Yes! Kobe gives the Lakers the lead. 99-98. <laughs> That's what he does. What's your job? You know, you go, you fill out these... Killer, things. man. Killer. The question becomes, what is Killer. your job? <laughs> to break hearts. Kobe says, I'm just a flat-out killer. Give me the ball in killer. the end and watch what happens. Drains the three and the Lakers lead by one. Kobe going up for the lead. Yes! That means the game. You get to stop here, you get yourself a victory. Kobe looking for the basketball. He gets it. Kobe baseline jumper. Yes! Dude, that was tough. I love watching how players are able to get free while being harassed and trying to get denied the inbound entry. Four second difference. Trying to three. Good! Kobe a three! We doing that again? I think this was a mistake in the editing. That's what he does. Kobe says, I'm just a flat out killer. Give me the ball in the end and watch what happens. Drains the three in the Lakers. I didn't rewind anything. In Los Angeles, Kobe up against Wade. They clear it out. He'll go past Wade. The follow away. All even. Tied at 99. Three points. Dude, Kobe away. used to be, he used to That's give it to D Wade. Yeah, he, he's numb to it. I, I was at that game. I was at that game. This is the red versus blue, uh, blue versus white game. Kobe squad versus LeBron squad. There was a sense and energy from all the players after they knew who the best player on the planet was. He was doing all of the talking, and now you come to close the game. What's your first option, Joel? What's your only option, Joel? <laughs> and what's the result? Kobe Bryant with the lead. To Wade on a penetration. Kicks it back out to Bryant. Bryant Kobe it. Bryant and the gold medal game against Spain hit all the big shots. Coach K was like, give Kobe the ball, get the hell out of his way. He's been called upon to play defense. This could be a gigantic four-point play. Paul to Bryant. Bryant looking for an opening, gets in, the runner rolls in. Kobe Bryant knocks it down. It's an eight-point game. Well, you see why Kobe Bryant's on this team. Money under pressure. Seven seconds remaining, Raptors. 
Gave up 34 first quarter points. They trail by 18. They now lead by one. The bend on the offensive rebound here as well. Other than 24. Kobe Bryant pulls back. Kobe Bryant makes it. All over Bryant. Bryant I remember this game. Kicks it in the bottom. Back out Bryant. Shot clock at seven. There's good defense by Ray Allen. Amazing defense by Ray Allen. Better shot. That was that year Kobe was hitting buzzer beater after buzzer beater after clutch shot after clutch shot. That 2009-2010 season. It's like every other day he was hitting a game winner. This was another one of the game winners in that, during that time I was talking about. He is hard to believe. No, he's not. Amazing again at the buzzer. I love this because the staff is just watching his feet to see if he uh, steps out of bounds. Up against Jared Jack once again. To the free throw line on the fall away for the lead. Yes! Three seconds to play. Buckets. Fade away. I don't know how this guy does it, man. He has given the Lakers a two-point lead. They're out of time. Outs him. That'll do it. The Lakers survive the Toronto Raptors. Blake trying to help Kobe get free. Four seconds. Three seconds. With the left hand. My God. Kobe Bryant with just five points in the first half. At 11 points in the third quarter. Check out the move. Shot fake. Is that OJ Mayo? And it goes. I think that was OJ. Odom. Bryant. A three for the lead. It's in. With 4.3 remaining. And the Grizzlies call a full timeout. It's one of those that he's done it so many times that you almost expect it. Bryant against Wade. Right inside, falling down, banks it in at the buzzer. Got knocked to the ground, he wanted a call. He didn't get that, but he got the buzzer. For what benefit is the question? Good defense from right. Brian Jesus. <laughs> Eight points already here in the fourth quarter. Lakers by seven. Wade is guarding Brian. I remember this. Looking, gets it to Bryant. Bryant dribbling, has to put it up at the buzzer. Banks it in. <laughs> he banks in the. I was in my apartment. And the Lakers win the game. Shannon Brown. <laughs> Played that great. He cut it. He cut him off initially, right there. Off one leg, off the left leg, drifting left. What a disappointing loss for the Miami Heat, who played so well here in the fourth quarter. But Kobe Bryant, with 17 fourth quarter points, sends this place crazy. And the fans with a standing ovation for the late minutes of this game. And this pace is way, way, way too fast. Hayes picks up on the switch. The rotation. Kobe Bryant, who hits the jump shot. 
Kobe Brown on his second three-pointer of the game. Excellent ball denial from Artest. Bryant has to come outside to get it. Drives, fires a long three. Let's go at the buzzer. Kobe Bryant nails the three-pointer. Dude, that that was a tough that was a tough series. Having to deal with Artest and Shane Battier. Just gets it off in time and puts it in. A three-pointer for Kobe Bryant as the shot clock expires. The lead back up to 11. One out of five. Bryant, yes. What a shot. Dude, he made so many incredible shots in this game in that fourth quarter. Kobe Bryant has put in 15 points. All the things you talk about. Test with the two. With an acrobatic shot, and Kobe Bryant with a game high 17 points. Crowd on its feet, chanting defense. Smith now trying to defend Kobe Bryant. Gets rid of the ball, gets it back, better position. This is the Western Conference Finals. Kobe Bryant from downtown, and the Lakers regain the lead. That was a big bucket because we had lost home court advantage. Look at the determination on his face, Bryant. Now with 36. My goodness, mama, there goes that man. This is how you tell 20,000 people to sit down and be quiet. <laughs> Kobe Bryant, time and time again, lifts, locks, and loads. He always says there's nothing better than the sound of silence hitting a big shot on the road. <laughs> Bryant has to put it up, and he puts it in. That's a two-pointer for Kobe Bryant. When you talk about his high IQ, he understood. That was great defense. Three seconds, catches it. Better shot. The Lakers will now improve to 9-0 at home. There's a three. Bang! Finishing touches. The Lakers take game one. Shannon was ready to pound that. Oh, watch this behind the back. Oh, that was saucy. <laughs> Dude. Dude. Behind the back, loses him. Defender gathers, pump fake. And then a great player makes a tough shot. He turned and said, to the crowd. Shot clock down to five. Bryant drills the three pointer. Ray Ray was proud of him. But he used his body to create space on that. Watch this. Ray Ray crowd him. Pivot. Mm hmm. Getting up, influencing him to the base. Boom. Just like that. That's all you need. One dribble, step back, corner three. That should be labeled unfair. In for Kobe. He's going to take the shot. The mask Mamba. With three. With two. Kobe for the tie. Yes, sir. We're tied and going overtime. The Mamba. That's why I've always said throughout his career, I don't care what his shooting percentage is. He could be 0 for 10. I still would want him taking the last shot. Oh. Kobe now isolated on Jarrett Jack for the lead. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you made it. I've said many times that he's 0 for 10, 0 for 15. Who do you want taking one of your last shots? Still him because he feels like every shot he shoots going in. Going and that one definitely down the pipe. Did you see Trevor Reese's reaction on the Trevor, bench? Trevor knows. Yeah, Trevor knew. Trevor, Trevor knew he was going to take it and he knew it was going to go down. Vivian Blake, shot clock is down to four. Here's Kobe. Way outside. Oh, how about that shot? Kobe Bryant puts it up, beauty. From way outside. He's got 10 in the quarter and 25 for the game. And all the Knicks can do is shake their hands. I remember this. 
Off one leg, Larry Bird style. <laughs> that was Larry Bird style. That was Larry Legend style. Good screen set by Gasol. That's absolutely a three. And the Lakers have their first lead since the opening quarter. They I hated that OKC team, man. They were tough. Gasol getting it back to Bryant. Shot clock at five. Jab step. Puts up a three. Bang! Kobe Bryant from downtown for Kobe Bryant. Well, this is outstanding individual defense, but great offense. Dabo Cephalosha. I mean, that is why is that who that is? he is what he is. You hit more clutch buckets, Kobe? Second overtime. Ryan, tough shot. Dude, that was tough. Fading back off the left leg alone. The Dirk Nowitzki one foot step back. Again, this is just supremely gifted offense. The one foot step back. Yeah, that was Can't great defense, though. Did. Yep, that's not what Cephalosha. Dude, how many clutch buckets did he hit in this game? No doubt. Cephalosha crowds Ryan. Ryan again knocks it down. Golly. Ryan knocks it down. He makes some pay. This to Jordan and then Kobe Bryant with that double team coming just a little bit too late. That's just what he does. Gives it to Bryant. Seven on the shot clock. Kobe. Jesus. Wow. Butter. It's just that way, and the flaps are down as Kobe Bryant takes flight. That was phenomenal defense. Or let him take a three point attempt. Right now, he goes around. He's going to shoot to tie the game. Got it. We're tied at 77. It's 40. I think Kobe, he got 40 points. The team has 77. <laughs> pressure on him by saying you're going to have to make something because I am raises up and drills the triple wow. watch this Whoop. Mamba has an extra bite tonight and he jumped probably the highest on that one than he has on any of them tonight I, I, I'm being, I, I agree with you he looks as fresh as he's looked all right well all he knew right that now. he had to use his legs he's smart he knows it's all in, in my legs so he comes off this is the season he was carrying this team it's year, year 16 we had we had never seen a player that old play at this level at the time. He carried that team into the playoffs, tearing his Achilles. That's ridiculous. Totally ridiculous. I mean, what do you say about that? You're Byron Scott. You just not Barry. Colby's got to shoot. That didn't hit the rim. Yes. To beat the shot clock, Mr. Bryant, if you will. And he's still giving the official a long look. Be careful, number 24. Home three just to beat the buzzer. Look at that form. Look at that follow through. Jesus. Oh, my goodness. Oh. You can't have any empty trips now. You've got to score. Ryan with Howard rolling to the basket. And Kobe. clock is in issue. He's going to have to shoot it with three, with two. In trouble. Four stop. And in. Unbelievable. You know how hard that shot is to make. Wow. That's a double head fake from behind the three-point line with a man draped on you. Amazing. Man. To Kobe making this ridiculous double head fake from behind the arc. And then just elevate. And now she'll have it. Same game. Right on its feet. Lakers down. In trouble. Quickly. Bryant. Three from the corner. Yes! Kobe! You can't score any quicker than Dude, that. straight up willing this team. I mean, just catching fire. And I mean, nothing but bottom. 
Same game. He just literally took this game over. Ridiculous shots. Ridiculous shots. They can't believe it. <laughs> his, his ability to get free, though. How he shaded the uh, the two defenders at the last second. Somebody other than number 24 is going to have to take the last. I mean, this is up to, I mean, double him up. Why are you worried about anybody? He fakes. They're there. He elevates. He scores. And we're tied at 109. Now it's defense time with Toronto getting the basketball. But coming back again, the Lakers tonight. And Bryant gives them new life for now. Boy, Lakers. look at that composure. Let's the one guy fly by, and then the second guy, Rudy Gay, jumps to try to affect the shot, but it doesn't affect the shot. Bryant with the crowd roaring. Same game. Gray comes out to double. Kobe around him. Kobe down the middle. Don't you hold. Kobe Bryant. Aaron Gray came out way too early and way too high. I said Kobe would be able to walk around him. He just walked around Aaron Gray. Kidding. I mean, the lane was open, and the old man just went to the front of the rim again and kobe says come on out aaron you kidding me you can't guard me out here and look at look at that defense you're talking about a parting of the red sea stand in get a blocking foul get a get anything but don't just give him an uncontested dunk it amazes me the mindset of some of the players in the nba i mean we look back at this stretch one of the best stretches of his entire what will be a Hall of Fame career. That's Kobe. Three at the buzzer! Hello! And showing some emotion. That's why I say... <laughs> drooling and everything. You never know what that guy can do. He's got 23 with that one. Catch, fire. You fired up, Kobe? Yeah, I'd say you're fired up. Lakers lead it 79. 73. With Howard setting the pick. In front of him is Horford. Bryant with 10 on the shot clock. Bryant to the dribble. Bryant attacks all the way. Scores! Lakers lead. Nine seconds left. Kobe drives and scores. Puts him in a position where they still have a chance as he attacks right at Josh. That was a tough angle. I don't even, I don't even know how he found that angle. Nine seconds. Count him. Nine seconds. Steal. 114, 111. Bryant, six on the shot clock. On a 12-3 run, Kobe got it! Kobe's got Dude, it! Dude, there's this game against the New Orleans Pelicans. The Lakers had no business even being in that game. This guy just started going nuts in the fourth quarter. Wave the finger, Kobe. Wave the finger. Wave it. 116-111. Dwight Howard. Need a bucket. Jody Meeks. Who's got it? Kobe's got it! Yes! Bryant down by three, 36 seconds to play. Well, this is the stop you have again. I mean, right to uh, Danilo Gallinari is Kobe got the fans up on their feet with his three-pointer to close to within three. And how about this? Just six field goals made by the Lakers in the last 16 minutes. And they're all by Kobe as he hits that one. And now you got a foul. How about that? <laughs> he said, it don't matter. I'm going to will this team. Over JaVale McGee. That's a very difficult three-point shot. Starting assignment. He's gone 32 minutes. Colby, three. Yes! Big one, Bryant, from outside. 107-104. Three-point game, five minutes left. Colby, guarded by the rookie, Harrison Barnes. Colby, one-on-one, -on -one, isolated for the tie. He's got it. It's 107 -0. The Mamba is looking like the Mamba. The Lakers need a score because even if they get a three, they're still down. They yeah. have to. I remember this game. Three on its way. Got it. Hey. Brian, One of my good friends is a Pacers fan. Look at me. Go. Come on. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Catch. 
and fire. I mean, <laughs> Dude, he slung that shit. It's down to one. Bryant long three. Hit it. His first three of the night. The Lakers by nine. Bryant is 22 points. Second. Well, about a second and a half separating the shot clock and the game clock. Down by one. Bryant for the lead. Kobe Bryant gives the Lakers the lead with 12.4. Kobe was not about to pass that one. Picked up the dribble. Kobe Bryant, 32,000 points in his career. And he gets a free throw for the end one. 107, 102. He ran 50 point game in that face. Oh man, he is. I was at Kobe's final game. I said once I hit 1,000 subs, which I did, I would start putting out videos for my cell phone from iconic Kobe games that I got to witness. And I will do that. I got a lot of footage from from this game, this last game. Bryant on his way. It's a one point game. He's so tired he can barely pick his feet up. Look at him, but he continues to wheel himself. He has the ability to wheel himself and puts his wheel on the opposition is amazing. Fifty six points. That guy, look at him. He's just slugging along, and all of a sudden, he just rears up and bam! <laughs> and then he runs down the court. It's like, oh wow, still got a minute and something to go. Lakers will get a chance to take the lead, and look who has the ball. Dude, the, the, <laughs> being in that arena was amazing. With half a minute to play, Bryant for the lead. Yes! Kobe Bryant gives the Lakers the lead. This is, you know, he was legendary before this game. <laughs> this, is, this takes it to an absolute another level. An absolute another level. Oh my goodness. They've been trying to trap him, so he goes away from it and then pulls up and knocks down the long deuce. He's got 58. And the good news is the Lakers have a chance at the final shot because the game clock is at yeah. 31. Rest in peace, Black Mamba. So, like I said, there was a lot. There's a lot. That's not even, that's not even like half of, uh, you know, Kobe's clutch performances and things like that. And there were some videos in there that were like buzzer beaters in the second quarter or third quarter. They weren't really clutch shots, but... Depending on how you look at it, they weren't near the end of the game. But he has, he has so, think, think about all, like I said, there was barely anything, barely anything in there from, you know, his first seven or eight years. And he had a lot of moments then. So you can imagine how long you could sit here just watching Kobe Bryant clutch performances. And I'm glad they just didn't do buzzer beaters because you can hit a bunch of clutch buckets just to keep your team afloat. Just to put them back in, into the game, put them in a position to win, you know, clutch bucket after clutch bucket. Might be twenty four seconds left, might be a minute left, might be within two minutes, might might be three minutes, but crunch time, crunch time. And I've seen plenty of Kobe clutch performances and losses. And what I mean by that is a dude will hit bucket after bucket after bucket, and then not necessarily that he missed the last the last go ahead game winner. It's that the defense or, or the other team got the final play and then they hit the shot, maybe a defensive lapse or whatever the case may be, but the opposition ended up scoring. Just because they lost doesn't make those shots not clutch anymore. Those were clutch buckets. But they didn't end up winning the game. Doesn't mean they don't count. It sucks that you took the L, but he still had a clutch performance, albeit in a loss. Shit happens. That's how I look at it. Some people are like, well, if you lose the game, then it just doesn't count anymore. It's just, you don't even talk about it. I mean, I get it, but I mean, still, clutch performance, but came up short. That's how I look at it. It's what the Mamba does, man. I, I, I'm going to keep doing my Kobe videos. 
uh, shed light on the player that he was because there's a lot of misinformation going out there and a lot of disrespect to being Bryant that I do not, I do not, I don't mind factual information, but it's shit that's not really factual or like misinformation. That's when I'm like, all right, pause. Let's talk about this. Let's really talk about this. Man, I miss, I miss watching Kobe play, man. It, it was, watching Kobe play was beautiful, beautiful basketball. It was, it was art. It was art. Him, when him, Kevin Garnett, Tim Duncan, when those three guys hung it up here, those last couple years when they are all in together, that was the last of their breed, man. Uh, that was it. Now, it's all bubblegum, lollipops, soft, buddy-buddy, load management, all that stuff. Well, was, I can't really talk about t uh, Tim D Tim Duncan wasn't a load managing player. He just was under Greg Popovich, so Popovich would rest his players a lot. But we know Kobe did Kobe didn't stand for that shit more than anybody. Um, I'm not gonna say in the history of the league, but during their during Kobe's time as a player, more than anybody, he did not stand for that. Him him and Larry Bird had the same mindset for getting up, putting on your work hat, and going to work. You know what I mean? Definitely one of the most clutch players to ever grace the NBA is Kobe Bryant. And like I said, the best difficult shot maker I have ever seen. I have ever seen. The level of difficulty of, of a lot of shots he, he's able to hit, man, it's just crazy, man. Not just clutch ones. Like he had a, a lot of, you know, highly improbable shots that we were making it in this video, but I'm not, I'm, I'm just talking about throughout the course of 48 minutes this type of shit I've seen him hit. It's like, wow. Kobe would do things that just make you scratch your head. Like every game, he would just do things that you, you've never seen before. It's like, wow, I, I've never seen that. And some things you might have seen, they're like, oh, that reminds me of Mike. <laughs> you know what I mean? That's all I got to say about it. Like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell. Go check out our Kobe Bryant playlist, our reaction video playlist, all our playlists. Go check them out. If you know any Kobe fans, bring them over. Tell them you have a home here on Boo TV. We, we, we pay homage to Kobe being Bryant. And we speak of Kobe in the truth. Can I get an amen? Now, like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell, stay notified. I'll catch you on the next one. We out, baby.